among the relatively small number of comments that I receive on this channel, a near majority of them refer to a common issue. That is, with all of the castor and coconut oil videos that I've released, people wonder why I still haven't described the application process. Well, it turns out that I actually have described this process before, but the video that I do so in was kind of long-winded and maybe hard to follow. That being said, I hope to teach each of you the ins and outs of this otherwise annoying process and hope that it helps. Step one, choose your oils. Now, I personally make use of coconut oil and castor oil for my hair regrowth process. Choosing the oils that work best for you is something that you can play around with, but I'll save that topic for another video. Now, you guys also might be curious as to how much of each oil to use. Some people have more hair than others, so this will definitely vary. My rule of thumb is to use three parts of the thinner oil and one part of the thicker oil. No matter the actual quantity, sticking to that rule will be sufficient so long as you mix the oils well. Now that brings me to step two, which is to mix the oils and comb your hair prior to application. When using oils that have a more viscous consistency, like castor oil, for example, I think it's best to make sure that you mediate that with a thinner oil. Coconut oil will be my mediator here, but anything from grapeseed oil to argan oil can offer the same effect. Again, <laughs> for another video. <laughs> now, before or after thoroughly mixing your oils, make sure to likewise thoroughly comb your hair. Untangling the strands of your hair will offer an optimized foundation for when you apply the oils, as it helps to mitigate an otherwise messy and uneven application. Step three, apply the oils gently. Make sure to massage the oils into your roots and through the rest of your hair. Repeat this process until you've either used up your mixture or feel that your hair is sufficiently covered in the, in the oils. As an aside, I also like to uh, rub the oils around my hairline to be sure that I'm covering all bases for the hair regrowth process. Step four, comb your hair and cover your pillow. You heard that right, I actually go to bed with these oils in my hair and I do so every other night. To prepare for that, comb through your hair once more using a comb that you're willing to get covered in oil and cover up your pillow with a throwaway t-shirt or a new pillowcase. Step five, you're done. At this point, the application process is complete. To remove the oils from your hair, just shampoo your hair out the next morning. Now, one last random note. I actually used to microwave these oils before applying them to my scalp, but I found that the loss in beneficial nutrients is not actually worth the easier application that the more thin microwaved oils supply. With that in mind, I hope you guys have an awesome day. Keep consistent, and I'll see you soon.